Ashawilu has been taking a look around right there on your screen. Those are the fresh footage that we are getting from the Westgate Mall. And we can just make out that is, of course, uh, the, the floors that have been caving in. Remember, we did hear from the president yesterday saying that three floors of the Westgate Mall did indeed collapse. That is just the, f uh, the latest footage we are getting from Westgate Mall. We can just make out uh, just... Uh, the floors that have caved in and a lot of space uh, in between there, of course, uh, that is the Westgate Mall. The latest uh, smoke is still billowing from that particular building. And those are the latest pictures. Massive destruction, of course, from the pictures that you're seeing on our screen, of course. That footage that you're seeing on your screen is courtesy of the Kenya Defense Forces. They have shared those pictures with us. That is the, the latest result of that hostage situation that was at Westgate Mall uh, in Westlands in Nairobi. That is uh, an assault that began on Saturday morning at about 11.30. Right now, the figures that you're working with, the figures that you're getting from the government, is that 62 people have died, 175 actually over 200 have been injured in this what we know now is that forensic experts are going through the rubble to try and figure out if they can get any sort of uh, evidence the identity of the attackers is still unknown and uh, if you recall yesterday president Uhuru Kenyatta declared three days of national mourning beginning today and he said that flags are going to fly at half mast uh, in respect of the men women and children who lost their lives in this attack and you can just see to the right of that picture uh, a part of that uh, parking lot on the rooftop of the Westgate Mall, which of course uh, we did uh, see in the final hours on Sunday as we saw that fire that uh, <coughs> caught that particular building. There was uh, some controversy as to what exactly caused uh, that fire and uh, you can see damaged vehicles there, some of them just fallen into the particular building after the collapse of the